Okay, now the device is powered on and it has been connected with the phone. Collect, uh, we click USB connect and now click OK. Now set the innovation parameter finished. And uh, if you want to go with slum mode, you can just go ahead and press press and hold this start button. But today I will show you the, how the RTK works. So we click this uh, set button here and uh, there are three types, basic, RTK and firmware. Uh, in this case I will go in, I'm going to click RTK and in this, in this uh, dialog you can input IP address, port number, mount port, account and password. And uh, make sure the IP address needs to be uh, at the IP, the IP mode. Don't input the uh, screen like the domain name. And uh, now I confirm everything is correct. I click the connect button and it says RTK server connection successful. Now I'm going to click and uh, hold this button. Input a project name, click confirm. Now choose auto. Here's okay, wait a moment. Send me start command with project name. Now it starts successfully. You can notice that the, um, the time starts to ticking and if the LED state is changing and the sensors start to rotate. We need to wait about 80 seconds, 1 minute and uh, 20 seconds. If you pay attention to this place, the, the status bar. Now it starts changing. The RTK single point. Fixed solution, which is very good. And the satellite number is, 80, is 38, 34, 35. So far, so good. Need to keep waiting for another um, 30 seconds. Okay, about 10 seconds to go. You need to wait until this tea light to become solid. You see, you can notice that the uh, Light field, the top one starts showing up. Now the T light is solid. We are ready to grab the device and start scanning. You can notice there's a red dot in the middle of the top point as your moving trajectory. So you can now, normally now you can grab the device and start to scanning. Uh, whenever you finish the scanning, you want to stop it, just click this stop button and then hold it and uh, it's stopped. You can close, you can power off your device and uh, power off the application and start to calculate the data.